Hey everyone, Rat Benatar here from the All Rats team, part of the Third Web community, and today we are talking about split contracts. Split contracts are what make it easy to distribute earned revenue to different members of your Web3 team automatically at the point of each NFT sale. And guess what? It's so easy to set up, you won't even need any code to make it work. So, if you are either working as part of a DAO that manages a treasury, or you're just looking to launch an NFT drop with a team of people, this video is for you. As always, if you enjoy this content, please be sure to give the video a like, subscribe to our channel, and share it with a friend who may enjoy it. Alright, so I've got thirdweb.com pulled up here, and today I'm creating my split contract on a test network. But of course, you can launch this on Ethereum, Polygon, Phantom, or Avalanche. The contract I'm looking to launch is a split, and I'm immediately brought to this simple interface to build my splits. So real quick, let's think about the two immediate use cases for why I would want to set something like this up. If I'm part of a DAO, chances are we have a treasury. And let's say that we've agreed that 40% of all revenue earned is allocated to our treasury, our community fund. But then we also need to distribute funds to various teams or community members within our organization. We need a way to ensure that at every point of sale, whether a primary sale or a royalty from a secondary sale, funds are distributed appropriately. As part of a DAO, we don't want any one person to have control over distribution of funds, so it wouldn't make sense to have to do this manually. Similarly, maybe I'm just part of a small team of four people launching an NFT drop. Three of us have made this our life's work, and maybe one person came in towards the end for a day or two as part of a freelancing opportunity. I can set up these splits in any way that I wish, so long as I have all of the wallet addresses and my total percentages add up to 100%. When my percentages look good, I'm ready to deploy. Great. I can confirm that my percentages look good here, and now I'm almost done. So to recap, what we've done here is created a contract. That contract has its own address here, just like your personal wallet would have its own address. So what I'm going to do is copy that address for now and start building my NFT drop. You can either set this up for a brand new NFT drop or update the payout settings of an existing drop. And instead of letting the primary and secondary sales go right to my connected wallet, I'm now going to paste in the contract address from the split contract that we've set up. I'm going to place it in both fields. This percentage setting here is still important. This is the percentage that will be sent to your split contract of each secondary sale. A typical project will set their royalty percentage between 2.5% to 10%, depending on the scope of the project. So if you have a team member on your split contract that is set to receive 30% of each sale, well, in this case, they would be receiving 30% of that 10% of the sale. Finally, after you've made your sales, you'll probably want to know how to distribute the funds. At any point after some revenue has been earned, you can visit your split contract that you have set up and distribute. And that's all there is to it. Now, we think that this is especially helpful for small Web3 teams and DAO members. But I'm sure there's all kinds of fun and clever ways that you can come up with to use this. If you have any ideas that we didn't cover today or any questions about any of the content, please just share with us down below. We would love to hear from you. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time.